Hi guys, so today I'm going to be filming an updated Reborn collection for 2017. So technically this is like my first Reborn collection of this year, but it's kind of an updated version because I try and do one every year. So as you can see, I have eight babies currently in my collection. I have five girls and two, no, three boys. <laughs> two boys, no, one, two or three. Um, two of my babies are bold, two have painted hair and the rest all have rooted hair. Technically Ivy here is actually manufactured, but to me she's still reborn and she's my oldest reborn actually in my collection. So let's get started. So the first baby in my collection is Paisley. Paisley's full name is Paisley London Aria. She is the Tibby Kit by Donna Ruba and is 31 inches long. She has rooted brown hair and has really nice like green coloured eyes. She does have pierced ears but I haven't got any earrings in them at the moment. She also has three fourth limbs and is the sitting version of the TB kit. So there's also a uh, uh, standing version but I have the t sitting version. I got her on April the 6th I think 2016 and she's a really great asset of my collection. I absolutely love having toddlers. They're always so much fun to role play with and I have some videos planned with the toddlers I want to do. Um, for her personality I normally see her as quite um, outgoing, she's normally quite bouncy and jolly, she's very playful and she's a great big sister, she loves all her little brothers and sisters and never ever ever like runs away from them, she's always asking for hugs and kisses and I role play her at about two, two to two and a half years old and she normally wears between nine to twelve months and eighteen to twenty four month clothes but she does wear some two to three years clothes as well. So next we have Ivy. Ivy is the Ariana kit by Reva Schick. She's a manufactured reborn and I got her on November the 7th 2014. She was my second baby I ever had in my collection. My first baby was called Hannah and I got her May of that year. So I've been collecting for reborns for nearly three years now which is incredible. Um, she is about 28 inches long and wears six to nine months up to 18 to 24 month clothes. Um, but 8 to 24 months is normally quite big on her and I normally stick to about 12 to 18 months for her. Um, she does wear size 6 to 9 month shoes best. I forgot to mention but Paisley wears size 4 shoes which is like the smallest kid's shoe I think you can get for toddlers. But she has brown eyes and does have pierced ears which I don't know if you can see but I actually pierced her ears myself. She has blonde hair and it's not the best routine because of course she's manufactured but she has a lot of it and she's a bit like my little mini me. She has brown eyes and it's just so cute. Her personality, I see her as quite shy. She's very shy. She, she's not like her big sister. She's not as outgoing but she's still super fun when she is. She absolutely loves her little brothers and sisters and she does love her big sister but <laughs> they sometimes have a bit of rivalry going on because she's... A little bit younger and she's always wanting to play but of course Paisley being the older baby is like no I'm playing. <laughs> I normally role, her, role play her between one and a half to two years normally. I normally role play her just over one and a half at 19 months which is not exactly 18 months but it's not two years because I just think that's a good age for her. She's the, I always see my babies like an older age than their size normally just because I find it more fun to role play with her like that. So next we have the first boy. Kit is the Madeline kit by Janet Polgar. And I also forgot to mention Ivy's full name is Ivy May Jade. <laughs> um, his full name is Kit Matthew Carter. Um, he has really cute blue eyes and is normally wears three to six months clothing but he does fit some not three clothes as well. He's a really fun little baby and I actually rewarded him myself so he was a great project to work on over the summer and I had great fun making him. Uh, I reborned him on July the 26th 2016 so he's not that old. Um, he's not in many videos because I do like to preserve him. He does have some boo-boos on his leg where my dad put his kit in the car um, like, when, like when I'd just finished him and I didn't have a body on me for him and sadly he, my dad actually put him on a pen. But it just looks like little bruises on his leg, which isn't the best, but it's on his like the top of his leg, so 
like trousers and shorts luckily do cover that up he has three quarter legs and like seven eight arms his arms is kind of like three quarter length but they're not Ivy's actually got full arms and legs but I role play him at about five months and I see him as quite um a loud and bubbly baby he eats a lot and is very like well behaved so the next baby I'm going to be talking about is Liberty. Liberty's full name is Liberty Isabella Grace. She is the Lucy Kit by Tina Kiwi and has full arms and three quarter legs. She wears not to three and three to six month clothing like Kit does and I normally roll play her at about four and a half to five month old. She's a very calm and relaxed baby, feeds brilliantly, she's very chubby which is so cute. She has a very calm face, she has rooted blonde hair and I would like to pierce her ears in the future but I'm not really sure. Yellows and greys look really nice on her as you guys can see and she's got really nice feet size and they fit not three really well. Um, she... I don't know her limited edition number because she didn't come with a COA, I don't know her artist either but they are normally the... I know the Lucy kit is a sold out limited edition kit but I love having her in my collection and I got her on the 25th of September 2016. So the next baby is Little Miss Addie. Addie's full name is actually Adeline. Um, let me just think of her middle name guys, I can never remember. Okay that was so bad of me. Her full name is Adeline Daisy Faith. I had a block memory for a second. I just had to think about it. Um, she is the Jack Kit by Tina Curie and has full arms and legs. She wears not to three month clothing and has painted hair. She is one of only two babies in my collection who actually have painted hair. And I'll see if I can show you. You can kind of see her painted hair there. She has really nice painted hair. Um... I role play her about 12 to 15 weeks, so between 3 and 4 months. She's a very relaxed baby. A lot of them are very relaxed babies, <laughs> I always find. Um, she likes to sleep a lot, and but when she's hungry she will scream her head off, it's normally how I see her. And I got Addie on June the 12th, 2016, and she's reborn by Royal Ascot Reborns. Next to Addy we have little baby Noah. Noah's full name is Noah Xavier James. He was reborn by Hugs and Dreams Nursery and I got him on November the 29th 2015. He was actually my first boy in my collection and he's always been such a sweet little boy. He is the Kit Thomas by Hootie Babies and has really nice rooted hair. He's got the best rooted hair of all my babies. But this is a quick glimpse. He's got really nice soft mo hair. Um, he has three quarter limbs and is an older vinyl so he's not like soft like the other babies, he's a lot harder than vinyl but I don't mind because he's really fun to like role play with. I role play him as a newborn, he's my smallest baby in my collection at about 20 inches long so he is my smallest little boy. Um, he... It looks like he doesn't have eyelashes, but he does. They're just really, really fine eyelashes. <laughs> but he's so cute. And he's always been one of my favourites in my collection. He's actually Damien's favourite as well. I see him as a very sleepy little boy. He's very quiet. He's not too fussy. He gets content very easily. And he's just normally a happy, bubbly baby. So next we have Baby Autumn. Autumn's full name is Autumn Carly Quinn and she is the Noah kit by Reva Schick. She normally wears newborn and not to three clothes but I generally put her in not to three just because it looks better on her but she also does wear some like up to a month clothes. She has really nice painted hair and she was reborn by Carly Louise from Carly's Cradle. Carly and I are fantastic friends and I can't thank Carly enough for making me awesome. She is my absolute favourite baby girl. <laughs> I shouldn't have favourites, but I do. She's so cuddly and so cosy. I absolutely love having a sweet little girl like her. 
I always role play her as a quiet baby, just like Noah is. Um, I role play her at about four to six weeks old, which she could be technically classed as older because she does have a slightly mature look to her, which I really like. And Carly painted her so finely and with so much detail. This camera would never pick all the detail up, but I'm so thankful to have her in my collection. I got her on October the 9th, 2007, no, 2016, but she was um, actually reborn on the 7th of October 2016, just a couple of days before I actually got her. So I got her at the doll show and it was great to spend the day with Carly and absolutely, like, I'm so thankful for that. And I love Autumn to Pieces, she's my absolute favourite baby girl. And finally we have Mr. Pablo. So Pablo is my newest baby in my collection. I didn't really do this in any order, it's just he came last. <laughs> but he is obviously the Sasuke kit by Bonnie Brown and he is the second edition of the Sasuke kit which was um, released between February and July of 2016. I believe that um, Pablo was reborn in September of 2016 but I got him on the 11th of October so literally two days after I got Autumn. Um, he has no hair, he's a bold baby, <laughs> poor little guy, but he doesn't mind. He has brown eyes, he did originally have baby blue eyes but um, sadly they just slipped when I think my godmum was holding him so I put in these really nice brown eyes and they look really cute on him but he um, has full arms and legs I forgot to mention Autumn has three quarter arms on full legs um, but he has a little open mouth and it's so cute for like videos because like his eyes have given him a bit more mature look than when I first got him but I really love that um, he's about 21 inches and wears 0 to 3 month clothes and shoes, like not three shoes fit him brilliantly. I absolutely love not sho not three shoes on him. He was reborn by Ellie's Enchanted Cradle and I absolutely loved her work before I even got Pablo. And when I got the chance to actually have Pablo, it was fantastic. And I was able to get some of her work. He does actually have little eyebrows and really like fine details in his skin. He has two scratch marks and even milk spots. He's the only baby I've ever had with milk spots. And he's got like a really newborn tone to him and I absolutely love it on him. He's my absolute favourite baby for taking walks apart from Autumn. They're my two favourites I love to take out. <laughs> um, I see him as quite a mischievous and curious boy. He doesn't make too much fuss but um, I like to roleplay him about eight weeks old. And he, he wears a lot of hats, does Pablo. Pablo is like my hat baby. But yeah. That was my whole collection guys, I'll just show you them all once again. So here they all are once again, so all eight of my babies. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you did don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you soon. Bye everyone.